Hello, good morning, and happy Father's Day. Uh, this is a weird memory to have, but I vividly remember 10 years ago giving my first sermon at Greenfield, and it happened to be also on Father's Day. Um, I said some nice things about my dad, which I would believe to still be true today, and that was kind of my Father's Day gift to him. Uh, can you guys think of some nice things about your dad? Yeah, you can. Um, what else? Did you did you tell him that or just or just me? You should, you should go tell him. I'll give you a few moments. Nice. Happy Father's Day, dads. Now, memories can be a pretty fun thing. They can be pretty awesome, huh? Um, some of us have some really good m memories about people, or we have some really good memories about things, or we have some really good memories about places. Um, but with that said, with good memories come some bad memories too. And some of us have some memories that aren't very awesome. I have a question for you um, about memories kind of, but the reverse. So if a memory is something that happened prior, so before now, what would you call like, a memory, a memory that would happen in the future. You see, if you were in our pre-church school gathering this morning, you know we talked about this a little bit. Um, but for those of you who weren't able to join us, Pastor Tyler today is going to be talking about thinking ahead um, to the future, to our dreams and hopes, and relying on God's faithfulness and promises as we enter into that space of what's to come, of what is ahead. And the story he's sharing today is from a time where people who followed God were in a dark place. The memories they had weren't super awesome, and yet God told them that he will come to them and fulfill his good promises to bring them back to their home. He promised them that he would come, and, and the people had to rely on God's promise even in those not awesome times. And the lesson for us today was that when we try to create future memories, those hopes, future dreams, let's remember the promises God gives us and rely on his faithfulness to pull us through. And so I hope you guys get to listen and learn that lesson today as well. See you soon.